All right, you guys, get ready. Have your notepads ready, a pen ready. If you're driving, no worries, because you can go ahead and rewatch this. We will have this posted where you can come back and you can listen to the training later. We want you to focus on your driving, but we have an incredible training and an inc incredible trainer lined up for you right now. Guys, this is someone that she's so, oh my gosh, she's so intentional with her time, her thoughts, her energy. And I just love everything about this woman. She's incredible. She's exciting. She's a ball of fun. <laughs> she is so much fun, but she, the best of the best of everything is she knows a hundred percent of what we all need to know and what all, we all need to be trained on at just any moment in time here at Dream Trips International. And so what I'd like to do is bring on somebody that is incredible at talking about getting your mind right, creating a good strategy, putting something in place for yourself to succeed. And so I am excited to bring on our trainer for today's call, Kylie, beautiful Kylie from Australia, Thompson, please join us. So good to have you. Hello, everybody. Hello, Tammy. You're looking beautiful. I love your pendant. It's my heart. You've inspired <laughs> me. It is a heart. Yes. <laughs> you take it yes. away. Thank you so much. Thank you, beautiful lady, for your kind words. Well, hello, everybody. It's Kick-Ass Kylie here. So give me some numbers in the chat out of 10. How fired up are you right now about how you're feeling about your life, about your dream trips business. And I don't just put tens in there. Like I want you to be really honest because today, if it's okay, I would love you guys to give me permission to have a really straight up kick-ass heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you guys. Is that okay? If that's okay, give me a yes in the chat because you know what? You know, I've had mentors in my life and trainers who've been incredible and they've been you know those people who kiss my ass and that feels nice at the time but I have gotten way further in my life from people who kick my ass yep that's it Mark Smith Mama Kylie is about to kick ass today but I'm not going to do it without your permission because you know we are in the love month this is February, guys. I love February. And it's our time to love ourselves, to love our business, and to create a life that we love. So the theme for today is love, but I'm going to kick your ass with love, but only with your permission. So yes, I'm getting you some yeses. So coming back to that number that I asked in the in the beginning, you know, what number out of 10 are you? Because people get attracted to those people who like their sparkle meter is like 10 out of 10, right? That's why people reach out to me all the time. And if your sparkle meter is a three or a four or a five out of 10, and you're just, you know, complaining your way through the day and, you know, you are that energy vampire that sucks the life out of people's souls. Or Mark talked about the excuses the other day. If you're talking about the peanut butter of, you know, why I can't do this and it's this person's fault and all the things, then people aren't going to be attracted to that. So here's the first thing I want you to write down. Your life and your business is a reflection of you. I'm going to say that again. Your life and your business is a reflection of you. So guess what? If you're not where you want to be right now, there's only one person responsible for that and you've got to have a chat with that person in the mirror. So that's what today we're going to do, but we're going to do it with love. I want to be really clear. This is not about making you wrong this is not about making you feel guilty. This is not about anything that's disempowering or any stories that you might be making up in your head right now. That's just our BS, our belief system, and it is BS. So today we're actually going to reset our business. We're going to reset our life and we're going to do it with love. So the first thing that we need to do is we need to get real clarity. And I mean soul conscious clarity. What makes your heart sing? What makes you happy? Because I'm guessing that when you said yes to join Dream Trips, you didn't join because you wanted to do things you didn't want to do and have an unhappy life, right? We joined because we love travel. We want to create a passive income so that we can create a better lifestyle for ourselves, for our family, to create freedom, maybe to connect and meet other people. I don't know. Why did you join? 
And so then, you know, I'm guessing that that's something that you love. Now, there's only two things that will drive you to take action to make changes in your life. One of them is for pleasure, so for the things that we love. The other thing is to avoid pain. So what are the things that you don't want? And, you know, that avoiding pain is typically the stronger emotion and that's going to drive you more. So I just want to take a little moment and I want to ask you, and, and guys, this is a safe space. So I just want to create this for everybody. I want to give you all permission to be vulnerable today, to be real. And today is about that reset, which comes with taking responsibility and owning where you're at. Because leaders, you know, the difference between an amateur and a pro, a leader, a pro takes responsibility versus an amateur is going to blame and complain and have all the excuses in the world. And that's below the line behavior. And I know that every one of you on this call is a leader. Now, before I deep dive any more, I just want to do one more preface. And that is that, you know, I'm one leader in, as a part of this Dream Trips community. Every single one of you are leaders. And, you know, you all have incredible upline leadership. And guys, here's the thing. Every one of us is going to have a slightly different style. Yes, we have the, the one vision. We're all part of the same company. We're all one big team, but we all have our own style. And the really great thing about your Dream Trips business, and I'm giving you permission right now today, this is your business, it's your life, and you get to do it your way. And I want you to show up and build your business with love in a way that you love. If you love picking up the phone and calling people, great, do that. If you hate that, don't do that. If you love building online and doing social media posts, amazing, do that. If you don't love that, don't do it. There are so many ways that you can build this business. If you love having travel parties, bringing people around to your home, amazing, do that. If not, don't. If you love using Rapid Funnel, if you love using our ATM group, ad tag message, I mean, oh my goodness, there are so many ways to build this business, but you've got to build it in a way that is going to support you. So when I first joined this business nine years ago, my upline leader was old school. And they were all about big hotel meetings and, you know, going to, to lunch meetings and coffee meetings. And as a single mom, I just don't have time for that. You know, I, I have literally minutes a day that I need to be able to build my business. So I needed to find a way that I could leverage my time online, but not everybody wants to do it that way. So the, the, the preface for this whole thing is creating a business that you love and empowering you to do this in a way that makes your heart sing. I love doing social media posts to connect and inspire other people. And I also love to have connected conversations with people and showing that I care. And have you noticed with all, everything I'm talking about today, we're talking about doing things from a place of love. So let's just backtrack for a moment. And I want you to just really have a heart to heart with yourself right now. What are all of the things in your life that are frustrating you right now? What are the things that you're tolerating? What are the things that you are not happy with? And typically where you're not getting results in your business, you're out of integrity. Now, what do I mean by integrity? Integrity is the foundation of all results in any area of your life. So integrity, and, and this is the landmark forum definition, is to honor your word, to do what you said you would do, even if, you know, you didn't say it, you just thought it, or just the things that you know you should do is to honor your word, to do what you said by when and, and how you said you would do it. And where you're out of integrity, that's where you're not getting results. Now, we're all human. We are all out of integrity every single day, but it's about taking res responsibility and honoring your word, and that is going to be a massive difference in your relationships, in your health, in your business, in all areas of your life. So let's have a look at your dream trips business because we're all leaders and we're all taking 100% responsibility. And I just want you guys to know I'm sharing this with love and I'm having this conversation with myself as I'm talking to you. Where are you out of integrity in your business? Because guys, this is a really freaking simple business. I've been a business coach for 20 years 
and I have coached thousands of business owners, entrepreneurs, traditional businesses, online businesses, you name it. Over the last 20 years, I've seen every business model there is out there. And I've got to tell you, I chose this one because it's the best. It's a product that I absolutely love. I've been on over 40 dream trips. And oh my goodness, like we get paid to travel and have fun and hang out and do really cool epic stuff with our family and friends and our fellow dream trippers. Like, is that not a dream come true? It's leveraged. We can make so much money out of this if we follow the system, if we plug in, if we have integrity, if we build with love. It really is simple. And like, let's just for a moment come back to our system. 10 in play right away. It's having 10 conversations and then two a day. Like it doesn't get any simpler than that and being consistent. So why are we out of integrity? Where are we out of integrity? What's coming up for you? And I'd love you to just be really honest with yourself. Why aren't you doing what you know you should do? Because this is really, really simple, guys. So again, your business and your life is a reflection of you. Now, I don't know, you know, if every week you rock up and you see those names, you know, there's a, there's a familiar set of names in our top 10 recruiters list every single week. What's your mindset behind that? What are you saying to yourself? Are you saying, I'm a top 10 recruiter. I'm the number one income earner in the fastest growing team in Dream Trips. People reach out to me every single day. High vibe people reach out to me every single day to join my team. And is that what you're saying in your mind or are you saying, I can't be there? I'm not good enough. I couldn't do that. This is so hard. I don't know what I'm doing. No one will say yes. I've spoken to everybody that I know. How many of these stories are you telling yourself? Because this is going to make all the difference. Because whatever you think is what's going to happen in your business. You know, so we've got to start with this. But again, we've got to come from a place of love and we have to love ourselves. So part of my background, I don't know if you guys know, I used to own 13 gyms and I don't look like a sports model anymore. <laughs> I started traveling and, live, traveling and living life and having so much fun. But one of the trainings that I used to do um, with our annual conference is to love you. And love you with you being an acronym for you got to love yourself, love others, and love the universe. And in that order. So think of three, like an onion, right? So at the core, if you don't love yourself first, you can't love others. So you got to love others. So you got to love yourself. So I want you to just take a moment because remember your life and your business is a reflection of you. And if you're not loving yourself, that's going to be a massive handbrake and make it impossible for you to break through in your business. So given that we are in the love month, today is all about loving you. And it starts with this. What are the stories that you're telling yourself? We have this thing in our mind called our RAS, our reticular activation system. And our brain works a little bit like Google. Whatever you put in the search field, those, those words, they call it keywords. So you know, um, I want to lose weight. All of a sudden, everything goes through Google or the little robots and it looks for all of the posts of how to lose weight. I want to know how to build my network marketing business online. All of a sudden, you've got all this data. And here's the thing, questions are the answers. So whatever you're asking your brain or whatever you're telling your brain, your brain is then looking just like Google for all of the evidence to support that. And for ways to be able to do what your, what your thoughts are saying. So if you're saying, I can't do this, this is too hard, I don't like network marketing, I don't like my upline leader, I, I'm upset with Mark and Tammy, that, but whatever your story is, whatever your peanut butter brain is telling you, stop it. And what we can do is we can reprogram our brain. I like to call it, switch it. It's okay, Mark, I'm on your side. I'm loving you right now. So what are you telling your mind? So I, now we're going to do some work. So jump in the chat. What are some stories that we can tell our brain that are going to be empowering stories, empowering affirmations, empowering declarations that we can say to ourselves every single day so that we can love ourselves to be the best version that we can be 
to have our sparkle meter, our love meter shining at a 10 out of 10 so that we can attract more amazing peeps, high vibe leaders to join your Dream Trips team. I am Superman. I love that, Jeff Ross. I'm a great father. I love that, Matthew. That's awesome. Like when you say that, does that make you feel good? Like one of mine is I'm the number one income earner in the fastest growing team in Dream Trips. Every day, high vibe leaders reach out to join my team. Like, can you tell I've said that to myself just a couple of times? So what I'm the number one global DTI recruiter and sponsor. I love that, Jeff. Okay, there are lots of people on this call and I've got three of you commenting. So come on, Trish, I'm awesome at this business. I love it. That's great. Keep them coming, guys. Because here's the thing. This is a safe space. And I've, I've shared with you, you've got permission to be real. You can't go wrong here right? And I want you guys on the field. I want you guys playing. Spectators don't get results. Spectators don't get paid. So how are we going? Matthew, I'm going to, I'm going on an awesome, hang on, glasses back on. I'm going to go on amazing trips all over the world with my daughter. Yes, that's amazing. Come on, guys. There's lots more of you on here. Let's get these coming. What are those positive affirmations? Chris Miller, I'm adding 200 new members to my business. Yes, I love that. Now, guys, when you start these statements with I am, that makes them way more powerful. I am the number one recruiter. I am a whatever that looks like. I'm a successful connector, having welcomed tons of people into the DTI family where we share adventure and freedom. I love that. I'm a wealth creator. Shonda, that is fantastic. Jeff, I'm a great leader. Amazing, guys. Come on. we are still got like, I think we've probably got maybe 2% of you playing on the field right now. So for everybody else, it's okay if you're driving. If you're driving, you don't have to play. But this is so important for you to actually get in the game because spectators don't get paid. When you join Dream Trips, this is a business. Do you want to get paid? The number one goal in any business is to make profit, to get paid. That's what pros get paid, amateurs pay to play. So we all want to be a pro, right? And it comes with taking responsibility and making a decision right now that you're going to love yourself, you're going to love others, you're going to love the universe, and you're going to build this business from a place of love. I am the biggest travel ambassador. I love that, Thomas. Fantastic. Now, Matthew, I want to just give you a little bit of coaching. So Matthew said, I'm going to become a great leader. So your brain, what we want to do is you want to switch it. I am a great leader. I am the number one leader in dream trips. So you want to claim it like it's done, not I am going to, because that's still leaving it into the future. So we want to claim it that it's right now and we're bringing it into our bodies, our souls, our mind. We're feeling it. And then Matthew, beautiful. So Matthew now says, I'm a great leader. Now I want you to shout it out. I am a great leader. Hey, I love, I hope that there's a few of you like in coffee shops or parks right now. I want you to be yelling that out if you've got kids in the room. Doesn't matter. I'm a great leader. I'm the number one recruiter in dream trips. Like I, whatever it is, shout it out. Claim it, own it. Like actually get some energy into this, guys. Jeffrey Ross says, I'm a millionaire. I love it. What about, so we've talked about loving yourself, right? So for you to be the best version of you, for you to love yourself, to be able to absolutely kick ass in this business, how else can we love ourselves? Like, are we investing our time in personal development to sharpen the saw, to make sure that we are in the best mindset that we can be in? What about our health? On the 1st of January, I, I went vegan. So I've had a whole month of eating vegan, no alcohol. I've ditched four and a half kilos. I feel amazing. And I know it's just the beginning. And I did that as one of the key factors to love myself, to be able to build my dream trips business. For me to be the best leader I can be, I need to be healthy from the inside out. I'm a sexy 100 kilos. I love that, Jeff. One of my affirmations is I'm a happy, healthy, sexy, strong, 68 kilo size 10. Again, can you tell I've shared that with myself just a few times? So feel how powerful this is when you share these out loud, guys. So your homework from this first part of this call is to actually 
come up with your own declarations to write them down. And guys, this should take no longer than a minute to share these. And I want you to start sharing these with yourself in front of the mirror. The first thing you do in the morning, every single day to absolutely set yourself up for success and make 2024 your absolute best year yet. So I'm actually going to read you mine that I share with myself every single day. Now I'm human. Sometimes I don't share these. And when I don't, when I get out of the habit, that's when things start to crumble. As soon as I say these, oh my gosh, I feel freaking amazing. Now, I'm actually going to copy these into the chat for you. And uh, in the bottom right-hand corner of the chat, you've got three dots. So if you, let me just see if we can copy them. No, it doesn't want to paste them. Oh, there we go. Paste. No, it's not letting me. I'll, um, I'll pop them into the Facebook group. If you guys aren't in the DTI Connection group, make sure you're in there and I'll pop them in there. You can also get the recording, the replay of this, and you can um, check it out as well. All righty. Are we ready? Give me some eights because eight's my favorite number. Eight's infinity, which means anything is possible. Give me some eights if you're ready to hear these daily declarations so that you can actually create your own. Loving the eights, guys. Thank you. I'm getting a lot more participation with the eights than I was with the declarations, team. All right, guys. I am Kick-Ass Kylie. I'm the crazy, fun, out-of-the-box millionaire mum. I am the possibility of power and inspiration. I win the day because I have faith, courage, and enthusiasm. I'm blessing and impacting lives all over the world. I'm focused and productive to achieve all my goals. I'm a happy, healthy, sexy, strong, 68 kilo size 10. I follow my dreams and do what makes my heart sing. I'm a money magnet. Money flows to me. I make in excess of 10K per day. I empower others to dream big, to believe again and play. I'm a personal development junkie who loves to learn and read. I continuously grow daily to be the best version of me. I'm a woman on a mission with a passion and a vision. In my heart, I'm believing what in my soul I'm dreaming. I'm strong. I'm sexy. I am ready. I am the crazy, courageous, confident, kick-ass Kylie. And that is who I am. I'm the number one income earner in the fastest growing team in Dream Trips. I'm the leader that other leaders are looking for. I am so grateful that every day high vibe leaders reach out to me to join my Dream Trips team. And I am on a mission to help 10,000 people make 10,000 passive income a month, working less than 10 hours a week and taking 10 or more Dream Trips a year. I am so grateful that I have multiple streams of income making more than six figures every single month. And I'm so grateful that abundance comes to me easily and effortlessly on a consistent and daily basis. Woo! Okay. I feel so freaking powerful right now from just sharing that with you guys. And that is how I start my day, guys. So you don't need to have, I literally have goosebumps right now. Like every time I declare this, it feels amazing. But actually doing this on the call with you as well, it's like it's magnified. So I would love for each of you to create your version of that. Because remember, thoughts become things. Whatever you think, that's what you create. You are the author of your own life. And it starts with loving yourself. It starts with telling yourself empowering stories. Love, give yourself a hug right now. Like when is the last time that you hugged yourself and said, I love you? Thank you, body. Thank you, mind. Thank you, soul. I'm so grateful for you. Probably not ever. And for some of you, that's going to be really tough because we're so busy beating ourselves up and getting stuck in perfectionism and all the things in our head. The most important journey that we can take in our lives, which is going to make a profound difference in your business, is a journey that's about three hands. The journey from your head to your heart. When you can get out of your head and stop with all the excuses and the comparitis and the perfectionism and all the other crap that goes on in there and the disempowering stories and the excuses and the da 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 or as Mark says, the peanut butter, get rid of the peanut butter brain. And I've got to tell you, eating vegan and ditching the alcohol, I ha feel like I've actually don't have that brain fog anymore. I feel like I've got so much clarity. I feel alive. And when we can come into our hearts 
and remember why we got started. Like, why are you here? Why did you say yes? What do you want for yourself, for your life, for your family? And what's the contribution that you want to make in the world? Why are you here? Now, we're going to circle back to why in just a moment. So I touched on the what are you tolerating? What are you frustrated by? You know, what are the things that, you know, you're not happy about in your life? Because, you know what, we are on this planet for such a short freaking period of time. And I want to give you guys permission to do what you love, to live a life that you love, to build this business in a way that you love, that fires you up, that makes you feel amazing. Because when you're doing that, oh my goodness, your team is going to explode and you're literally one decision away because your business is a reflection of you. When you love yourself, when you love what you do, when you show up with love, when you love other people, oh my goodness, you'll be loving all of the life that you've created. You'll be loving all the dream trips you'll be going on and you'll be loving the passive income that turns up into your account every freaking week while you're asleep. Like that's something to get excited about. But most of you are so stuck in your head. It's like you've got this massive handbrake on and it's time to let that sucker go. Bless and release. Let's come back into our hearts. Today is your day to reset. But we have to release the shit that's still there. So one of my mentors, and this was a Dream Trips training um, that I went to quite a few years ago, and one of my mentors said five words that changed my life literally forever. And those five words were walk away from the stress. Walk away from the stress. What are you doing right now that's stressing you? Are there people in your life that are doing your head in, that are sucking the life out of your soul? Walk away. Are you in a job where you feel unappreciated? You're underpaid. Maybe you're getting bullied at work. Walk away. Are you in a relationship where you're being abused, where you're not loved and appreciated? You got to love yourself and walk away. This is your time. Today is your reset. It's not a chance that we're on this call together right now. This is the love month. This is time to love you because unless you love you and you respect yourself and you start creating boundaries, everybody else is going to be controlling you like a puppet on strings and you're going to feel like you're in this washing machine getting pulled in every direction and be overwhelmed and stressed and frustrated and you're never going to get anywhere. Your life and your business is a reflection of you. So it's time to do what you love. And I'm empowering you. I'm giving you permission to walk away from the stress. Cut the ties. Some of you are so freaking worried about having other people like you that you're hanging out with all the wrong people and you're just getting the life sucked out of you and life is disappearing before your eyes. Dream trips is like the perfect opportunity for you to create a life you love, to get paid to travel, to have fun, to hang out with epic people to be the best version of you, to help other people. Like, how amazing is that? So, guys, I want to just shift gears slightly. We're still in the love conversation, but I want to talk about the six core human needs. Now, I'm sure you've all heard of Tony Robbins. He's pretty freaking amazing, and uh, I learned these from him. And most people don't have any of these, so there's six of them. And when you have all six, I've been told, I don't do drugs, but I've been told it is like the, I don't know, when you get on a high, like that euphoric feeling, um, but we can have that every single day. And I want to share these with you because we actually have this as part of DTI, which is why when you plug into the system, it's why when you plug into the community, when you show up on these calls, when you when you book a dream trip, you're going to get all of this. And this is what is literally going to change the world. So remember I talked about love you, love yourself, love others and love the universe. So we've talked about loving you. So now we're going to talk about loving others. And so we want to be able to deliver on these six core human needs. So one of them is certainty. In a world of uncertainty, people need certainty. And you know what? I freaking just want to massively acknowledge Mark and Tammy Smith right now, our incredible owners and, you know, here who show up every single week 
we have certainty like how amazing like I've never experienced this before every single week we have this call for you guys we have our owners our CEO the top global leaders in the company every single week show up on this call for you guys to serve you like I'm not getting paid to do this call today I'm doing this with love because and I'll talk about this in a second but it's to give you certainty right so that you get what you need to be able to go out there and build this business and save your dreams and help save other people's dreams like we are literally saving lives because most people are dying on the inside so certainty people need certainty the second thing is they need uncertainty they need variety because just think about it so many people out there are living groundhog day they're doing the same old thing day in day out day out like they've got They're just miserable. So many people out there are miserable. So when you're showing up on social media and you're on another dream trip, you've booked another dream trip, you're excited about this trip that's just come up, you're doing cool stuff. You're living a life that you love. Like people look at my Facebook all the time. They're just like, oh my gosh, you just, you're always doing cool stuff. You're always having fun. You're like, but that's a life by design. I made a decision to create that life. So how can you create that? uncertainty or variety in your life and the same with these calls right we have certainty that we have a weekly call we have uncertainty or we get the variety because every week is different we have different trainers that come on to to teach you to inspire you to empower you to be the best version of you the third one which is totally on topic for today is love and connection we all have a core human need to feel loved and do you know how many people out there in the world right now don't feel loved even even children who are in loving families because of the stories that they've made up in their head feel unloved I mean I'm sure if you guys have seen on social media you would think that you know my two children are the two most loved children on the planet but you know what there's still plenty of times that they don't feel loved we have to love on people If you want to feel more love, you've got to give more love. Give and you shall receive the law of reciprocity. So as part of your building strategy of building your dream trips business, who can you go out and love on today? One of my strategies is I send birthday messages every day to every single person I'm connected with on Facebook. Now, I had a lady the other day who's actually my dad's friend. I met her because I introduced her to dream trips a few years ago and I sent her a birthday message. She didn't reply to me. But she called my dad to say, oh, my gosh, Kylie sent me a birthday message for my birthday. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe she sent me a message and absolutely made my day. How are you showing up with love? How are you loving on other people? One of my strategies of how I build my dream trips business is I send a minimum of two messages a day. But I'm not in someone's inbox selling and spamming. I'm in someone's inbox saying, oh, my gosh, how are you? I haven't seen you for ages. I just saw your Facebook post. How are you? What's happening in your world? I'm asking questions because I care. I'm showing up with love. So how can you show up with love and shine in your business? Because when you make other people feel loved, law of reciprocity, they're going to be interested in what you do and they're going to come back. Pretty amazing, right? Our business is literally built on connections and on having connected heart-to-heart conversations with people. And remember I said earlier in the call, there's two key drivers that drive behavior, that drive people to take action, that drive change. One of them's for pleasure, the other one's to avoid pain. So when you start having those connected heart-to-heart conversations with people and you are being real and raw and vulnerable and authentic and showing that you care because of being a human, first a market a second eventually someone's going to share what they're dealing with they're going to share what their pain is what their problems are pain and problems equal profits because we've got the solution and we can help them with that we can help them from that struggle from where they're at we can show them a way through dream trips to be able to get the results now I'm just going to time out for two seconds because there'll be some of you right now that go, but I don't have results and and I can't help someone do that. You know what? There's plenty of people in this company getting amazing results, making plenty of money, having an amazing lifestyle and going on trips. So use their story. Get yourself out of the way. Put your hand up and ask for help. Get your upline leadership to support you because I used to share other people's stories 
until someone started sharing my story because I sucked at this at the beginning. I really did. It took me a year before I went on a dream trip. I didn't even understand what a dream trip was. So number one, if you haven't been on a dream trip, book a dream trip. It's your product knowledge. It's tax deductible. How amazing is that? Okay, so we talked about love and connection. Now, how are we finding these so far, guys? So we've talked about three. I've got three more to go. We're feeling good. Give me some fives if you're still with me. Love it. Thanks, Jeff. Got some fives coming through. Beautiful. Just want to make sure you're all still awake. <laughs> Thanks for the fives, Renee. It's great to have you back, beautiful lady. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, so we've talked about certainty, uncertainty, love and connection. We have another core human need, which is significance. We need to feel important. So when you show up to uh, a barbecue and all you do is talk about yourself and how important you are, guess what? People are going to run the other way versus make other people feel special and important. Tell me about you. Now, I have got a habit of I ask questions until and, and I want to be able to compliment someone. I, I, I like to think that I'm a professional complimenter. Don't go put on Facebook that I'm a professional complimenter because that's just cheesy and you're going to push people away. You want to reach out one-on-one -on -one and give people compliments, but they have to be genuine. They have to be real. They have to be authentic. They have to be from the heart. Practice that. Every time you see someone, even a stranger, I do it all day, every day. When I'm walking around, I'll see a lady, her hair's on, go, oh my gosh, your hair looks beautiful. Oh, wow, I love your dress. Oh my gosh, you've got a beautiful smile. Now, guys, you've got to be careful because it can come across sleazy like you're trying to hit on someone. So, you know, you've got to be mindful of how you do this. You've got to be responsible. But start showing up and giving people compliments. It is so easy to do. It makes people feel freaking amazing. And all of a sudden they're looking at you going, wow, every time I'm with you, I like, I feel really good. And then they want more of that. And then they're going to want to become part of your business. They're going to be interested in what you're doing. So stop talking about yourself and start complimenting and making other people feel important. Now, sadly, because so many people are not feeling that significance in their life right now, they feel like they're, you know, they're just a number. They don't even, they're, they're not important in the scale of things at all. Then what happens is people can start having a disempowering need for significance. So, you know, when you share a story, oh, this happened. Like you know, just the other day I was talking to someone and he's just um, recovering from prostate cancer. And he's like, oh my gosh, every time I talk to someone, they're like, oh yeah, but my dad had cancer. Or, oh, I had this, which was a bigger, bigger story. That's more drama, right? Disempowering need for significance. So we need to start building people up. Do you know how you get, you get leaders in your business? You build them. Because there is a leader in every single person that you talk to. You start building leaders. Okay, so we've talked about the four, four of the six human needs. The next two are like the spiritual needs. One of those is contribution. So how are you contributing? How are you helping other people? And this is a higher level need, right? It's why, especially down here in Australia, like when cyclones hit, oh my gosh, everyone rallies to, you know, to help and clean up Australia Day in March. Everyone wants to be a part of it. It's why, you know, when we run volunteers, you know, where we combine a dream trip with a, with a, a project where we can volunteer and give back, contribution, helping, giving back, making a difference. It's one of our core human needs. You know, as a girl guide, I made a promise to do my best and help other people. I feel great when I help other people. But for you to be able to help other people, remember, it's got to come back. You've also got to be open to receiving. And that comes back to loving yourself. So when people want to contribute to you, instead of saying, oh, no, it's right, just open your heart and say thank you. Because for you to be able to give and contribute to someone, someone else has to be open and receiving, right? And sometimes people can't help themselves. They're in that situation where, you know, they can't fight for themselves. Well, who, who are you fighting for when they can't fight for themselves? People will remember that. It's good karma. It will come back to you tenfold. So how are you contributing to others? And how are you opening a space for others to contribute to you? Mark Smith opened a space for me to be able to contribute to you today. And I'm so super grateful to Mark for that. So thank you, Mark. And the last one is learning. 
Because how good do we feel when we learn something new? That is one of our core human needs, which is why these calls every week are so important. It's why once a month when we have our Dream Trips Academy, oh my gosh, those calls are at one o'clock in the morning my time and I get up every single month because the learning is incredible. What are you putting into your mind every day? Like I've got a whole row of books here. You know, I've just um, given uh, my daughter a book, The Richest Man in Babylon, to learn about saving and money mindset. What are you reading to make yourself the best version of you? Learning, but it's not just about learning. You've been learning all morning, but it's then applying that learning. Okay, so there are our six core human needs. And the last thing that I just want to share as I wrap up my training, you know, we've, we've shared a whole lot of love today. Drop some love hearts if you're feeling the love. And uh, guys, I'm now going to kiss you. Mwah. Keep it simple, superstar. This business is super simple. We overcomplicate it in here. 80% of what you do is time-wasting stuff that you don't need to do. And I know every single one of you is so damn busy, right? We're all busy. Gosh, we're busier today than we've ever been in our entire lives. Time is just going so fast. You know, with technology, everything speeds up. So I want to give you permission to create some space. Start ditching some stuff that you don't love. Walk away from the stress. Simplify your life and simplify your dream trips business. Start sharing this with love. So your next action item as we wrap up this training is I want you, whatever platform you're on, with love to share a vulnerable post to the world. Because when you show up, as vulnerable, like the greatest, it's like the, the the greatest courage is being vulnerable and the magic is in the mess. So when you share your story and you share the vulnerability, then other people can relate to that. And so when it comes to dream trips, we've got this thing called a three-step setup. So a lot of you get stuck and you get in your head in how to share this. So we want to share why we got started, that step one. I want to share that this is a really big deal and we're all in with this, but we also want to take away to make it not salesy. So as a wrap up, I'm just going to share this with you guys. So let's just say that you're catching up, you're done, you're, you're doing your Facebook post and you're like, oh my gosh, guys, like four years ago, my husband left me just as COVID hit. Overnight, I had no income. I had no husband. I didn't even have a car and the whole world had gone crazy. My kids went through extreme depression. They were both suicidal. And I didn't know how we were going to move forward. And I hit rock bottom in my life. There was no travel. Borders were locked down. My dream trips business overnight was gone. No husband. All my coaching clients cancelled. They were all freaking out. And here I was, a single mum, broke, broken, distraught, devastated, my heart ripped out, wondering how on earth life was going to be able to go on. And it was really hard, the hardest time of my life. And I know many of you have had to deal with something similar. Many of you have probably gone through the same thing. Many of you struggle with COVID. There are so many people out there who are still struggling Yet tears in my eyes when I think about it. And the thing that hurts me the most was the impact that it had on my kids. I'm strong, I'm resilient. I know I'll always bounce back. But, you know, it's only now my kids have started to come back. And you know why? Because of dream trips. Dream trips has what actually gave me that fighting spirit again. It allowed me to dream again. You know, as a single mum struggling you know, for me to be able to check off Santorini, Athens, Hawaii, Punta Cana, the Whit Sundays, like, oh my gosh, so many trips. My ex husband contributes $30 a month for my two children, $30 a month. Financially, this has been the biggest struggle of my life. Do you know what's got me through this? Do you know why I've been able to actually buy my home? Thanks to dream trips. Thanks to having that extra income stream that's completely leveraged. You know, it has been 
like seriously life-changing for me. And the connections, the friendships, the love, the support, the learning, everything that we get here in this Dream Trips community has actually rebuilt me as a person to be the best I can be. And I know that I've got so much further to go. You guys can have this too. We can share this with other people. So that's why I'm all in the Dream Trips. This is a freaking big deal. Dream Trips is the number one travel club in the entire world. We give people their dreams back. We help people create a dream life. We help people have dream friends, go on dream holidays, have a dream income. Like, oh my gosh, this is the dream, guys. And it's right there in front of you. And all you got to do right now is make a decision. So I'm all in, but you know what? This isn't for everybody. And that's okay because people are watching you and it might just be that it's not for them right now, but it may be in the future. So let's stop selling this and start sharing this from a place of love and being real and raw and vulnerable and sharing part of our story because the magic is in the mess. That's what's relatable. So guys, with that, I love and appreciate every single one of you. I'm so proud of you for being part of Dream Trips in choosing to be the best version of you, to be here, to learn and grow today. Guys, what we have in our hands is such a beautiful gift please go share this with love to the rest of the world. Back to you, Tammy. Thank you so much, Kylie. What an amazing job. Thank you. I told you guys, she is just something else. Kylie, take a minute and just go through the, the, the chat. See all the love that everyone is giving you. Thank you for sharing your heart, your story, um, and teaching us the way. All of the things that you just touched on, every topic that you had brought up, I've seen you lead by example in your day-to-day -day activity. Day-to-day -day Kylie comes up and shows up as all of these different touch points that you just went through. Clarity, uh, uncertainty, love, connection, importance, contribution, um, and learning. You do it all, and I see it by your demonstration of it. So we appreciate you um, so much. We love that you are part of our Dream Trips family. Uh, everyone, you know, this is going to be on replay. You can go back and um, rewatch it for yourself or even let your team know about this fantastic training that people are going to want to come back to. It will be loaded on DTI Connection. And um, just give us a little bit because you know the download and then uploading, it takes a minute, but it will be up there in the next couple of hours. Um, thank you so much, Kylie. Amazing and beautiful. Before